Hi YouTubers, it's the Tech Guy here and today I'm going to show you how to hack your phone's password, pattern, or passcode. Let's get started. You want to run your ADB, oops, excuse me, you want to run your command prompt as an administrator. A prompt is going to come up, click yes. Now what you want to do is type in ADB devices. Sorry, hold on. Yep. There you go. After you do that, type in ADB shell. Sorry it's a little blurry, but just listen to my voice. Hit SU, I mean type in SU, then type in RM space slash data slash system slash gesture dot key now if you type in gesture dot key if you type in gesture dot key that um that command will hack the pattern lock on your phone if you type in password dot key then you're gonna type then you're gonna hack the password or passcode on your phone now I have a pattern lock sorry this phone's so shaky but I have a pattern lock, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit enter, and there, my the password on my phone is hacked. Just um, now, just for proof, what I'm gonna I'm gonna go to my phone, my uh, little small LG phone. I'm going to lock it, and I'm gonna put in any password I want. And on lock. And usually, look, you um with Android phones, you're supposed to have four dots like this in order to pass and, and unlock your phone. You could even put in one little dot and uh, it'll unlock. You could do this many times as you want, and it, it'll unlock. See? Now the reason because of this is because you set your phone as a pattern lock, right? But what you didn't know is that even though you said as a pattern lock, right here it says it's a swipe lock. If you see it, see, yeah, right there, see, it says a swipe lock, even though you said it as a pattern lock. That, that's why. Now, you can do the same commands I just showed you over Wi Fi if your phone is rooted. Uh,. And you can keep going from there. Uh, and there's one thing I forgot to say in the beginning of the this video. Your phone does need to be rooted. Everyone on YouTube is saying that your phone needs to be rooted. I can't stress this enough. Your phone does need to be rooted. Now, um... Oh, and, uh... You also need, if you, um, there's also a way that you could do this on your phone. I'll talk about that in a later video. But if you want to do it on your phone, you'll need Terminal Emulator, Super Su, Root Checker, and yeah, that basic stuff. That's it for today, guys. Please like and subscribe. I'm out. Peace.